Hi, I'm Jocelyn Kennecott. I'm Blake Riley. I'm Delaney Harm. And I'm AJ Whiting, and we're juniors from Gotham Brook High School. That's not funny! And this is our poem entitled, That's Not My Name. My name is Jocelyn. Inadequate. Inadequate. My name is Delaney. Just, Just free. free. My name is AJ. Perfectionist. Perfectionist. My name is Blake. Faggot. Faggot. Over time, our names have evolved through the way we see ourselves. We write adjectives on stickers and place them on our shirts, and then those become our, our names. names. Each day I wake up knowing that in the room next to mine, someone who shares the same genetic makeup, same parents, and birthday is going to wake up and understand that she's better at everything, and I will always be an inadequate. inadequate. Twins are supposed to be the same, but yet I'm left to think that I'm not enough. But how could I possibly think any different when I'm constantly hearing? I like your sister more than you. Which one are you anyways? Wow, your sister? Is so much better, I know. There isn't anything I wouldn't do to be, be more, more like, like your sister. sister. Walking through the halls, I wonder what people are thinking as they look at me. I fake a big smile, give as much love and support as I possibly can. But are there enough athletic clothes and broad boy insults I can tell to make people believe I was made normal like them? Crushes kept captive in my heart, slurs yelled through the halls, I can almost hear them whispering. Dude, I can't even change in the locker room anymore. It's Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. It's totally cool. I love having a gay best. Friends wonder why I waited so long to tell them, but it's because I thought they would use God hates fags to hurt me or tell me that who I am is wrong. Looking in the mirror, I pick and prod at what I could get rid of. The more that I look, the more I can imagine myself without. I criticize my body, but when I get to school, I receive compliments on being just, just pretty. pretty. But all I want is applause on my creative mind and grades. People are constantly reminding me. Oh, I'm sure there's talent in there somewhere. Nice rack, babe. Dang, I would love to see you in. That isn't who I am. My brain generates beautiful things, and I am not going to repeat. My eyes are up here. Each day, I check my grades. Every class period, I brood over my quizzes and assignments, wondering if any of it is good enough. I feel my heart skip a beat when I receive a 93%. But please do not make fun of me. I'm not trying to be a perfectionist. perfectionist. Good game is what I hear, but I'm not counting the points that I made. I'm counting all the ones that I didn't. When will people stop saying, Oh, stop, you did fine. You think your grades are bad? Look at mine. Jeez, not everything needs to be. Perfect is exactly what I'm striving for, and that's all I'll ever need to be. Don't you understand that this is who we are? This, this is, is who, who we're always going, going to be. be. We are going to carry these things with us forever. I will always question if they would rather have my sister there instead of me. How long should I have to stay in the closet before the world is ready for me to be myself? When, when will, will I be considered, considered good enough? enough? For everyone else. For myself. When, when will, will I be considered, considered the real me? me? All we're striving for is for you to remember our, our names. names. I am Blake. AJ. Delaney. Jocelyn. The, the outside, outside world, world knows us as... Inadequate. Just pretty. Perfectionist. Faggot. On the inside, we are, we are all, all silently, silently screaming, That's not my name! name.